Hey guys, Mark Angel said something in this video I want you all to watch. It is basically for all content creators across the world. You need to be encouraged and a lot are in this video for you to learn from. Stay tuned as I bring you this video. This is your first time coming across my video. Please try and subscribe to my YouTube channel and turn on your notification. Thank you. Watch the video. You to post the video and then to see that's look that is amazing so because i'm thinking as a normal human being it must be human psychology for you to post a video and then to see another skin maker post a video and the video is doing better than yours mm -hmm. i mean surely on occasion i'm so maybe not you because you are on top but surely it must be normal so maybe they now deal with those feelings but surely it must be normal for a skin maker to post a video and to not be so happy if the video didn't do so well and yet another colleague who posted about the same time the video is doing better i mean people must look at people's numbers and followings and say man this guy has x number of followers i still am on this level uh, and all of that you're saying that even with all of those feelings it still hasn't poisoned the well in any which way yes it still hasn't and if anybody is posting video and feeling bad that the video is not getting views or getting views is not the it is not the yardstick for measuring measuring your growth oh it's not no it's not views no, is not no. the yardstick for measuring your growth no it's not all right tell me what is so view is number right what that does that number interpret um lead that's what you should ask are you getting a million views and do you have about 10 or say five percent of leads from that view how many of that view have retention how many of those people are going to come back so you see some people have a lot of views and then you feel bad you don't even know what that person is going through they don't know that sometimes the algorithm is against them and giving them views yes the algorithm can be against, against you. you and give you views <laughs> okay please explain <laughs> yeah, let me see something so I can make a video now and get a um, hundred thousand views in a monetized platform and you make a video and get 25 million views you could make ten thousand dollars from that video and I make I made a video of hundred thousand views and I make about twenty thousand against your ten thousand people don't understand what some people just make content they don't understand why this content is doing too well who is watching this content for example there was a time i was making getting a lot of views a lot of views i studied what was going on i said hey no 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 this is not good for me this is not good for me why because those videos are coming from the wrong places if I went to the wrong place, uh, I have a lot of views from there. Have you ever tried to demonetize your video? You see how many views you get. That's how the algorithm works in most cases. Some people make content, they don't care where their views are coming from. You should care. You should know where to promote your video so that you make the most use of whatever view you get. Let your views count. Some people just have too many views without results. Onyageri, if it's Igbo, in Igbo we say, Onyageri, we now do good job. Now views do good job. We need, at least we need sustainability. What are you going to now use to sustain your craft? You know? And you're making content. You see that this content has views and then you're not going to make that same kind of content because you think that this is the content. Some people don't even have, some people are not, I'm sorry to say that there are so many not content creators in this piece. People who are just doing anything, anywhere below face. Mm. Ah, people are eating food now. Oh, this guy eat, ate food and got 50 million views. <sighs> Let me eat food. Because that's what they believe. And then they will eat food and get um, 50 million views. Our money will not come. <laughs> <laughs> and they will ask you, what's doing Facebook? <laughs> Is any other person passing through what I'm passing through? I say, you're passing through what you're passing through because I eat Facebook, YouTube, 
Netflix, who, uh, what, no matter who it is, they know who their content creators are. Because the advertisers don't just give out their money. The advertisers don't want you to put their, their content or their uh, materials on any, in just any video. They select the videos, they select the creators. You know, so that's the reason why you see when there are conferences, there are people that these people invite because those are the content creators, you know. Not just because people are making content, you just jump into it and start making it. Okay, so where where what are the wrong types of views? Where where, for example, don't you want your views to be coming from? I don't want to mention it. No, no, you have, to, it no you have to mention because no, this is people, no. because this will liberate people. Because no. I've heard this thing before. I've heard that not all views are created equal, you know. And I, I, it's not like I didn't believe it, but I figured I was only going to take that, uh, you know, that kind of assertion from an authority. And you are the authority. I mean, it's not as if look, it's not as if you're now uh, assailing anybody. Now it's it's the facts. Okay. These are the facts. This okay. is the truth. I'm going to try to explain this thing without mentioning anything, but I'm sure you understand this. In okay. fact, this should solve anybody that wants to know this yeah. should learn it now. We're in America. In America, okay, let me take for example, the food I ate just before this show was um, $30, $30, right? It's just food, just one plate of food. In Nigeria, that food is 30,000 or 32,000 naira right now. So you eat a plate of food for 32,000 naira. But because we're here, it's just 30, $30, right? Me and you can say, hey, it's just $30, right? Economy. Because of the economy of this place. If you give me $30 while I'm in Nigeria, you have blessed my life. If you give me thirty dollars while I'm here, now I'll go take your change. I see your money for grand. That's what it means, right? So I carry a bunch of change in my pocket. So every time, should I? I can show you. Like I carry a bunch of change every time in my pocket. It's change. It's change. Like I can say this is change, right? So when you say, do you have change? This is change. But well, let me tell you something practically. This is this is about seventy thousand naira. This is somebody's salary in Nigeria. Abi, if my money is coming from Nigeria, what do you think will happen? So, for example, now advertisers are advertising in Nigeria for one thousand naira. There's a 1,000 naira per day advert. I don't think there's a $1 per day advert here. You can't do a $1 per day advert. So an advertiser advertises for 1,000 naira. That's $1 to me. And your video shows in Nigeria or let's, I'm using Nigeria for example now. Your video shows in Nigeria and somebody clicks that advert and you make $1. Remember that it's split into two. The, other, the platform is going to take their own and take it. So you've made like 50 cents from one advert. Meanwhile, here, if that was like two, three dollars against you, I've made like one dollar and 50 cents. And 50 cents with the same view, the same thing, just the same thing that just happened there. It's just that it happened here, you know? So do I want my content to be coming from, or do I want my content to be? Mostly viewed where there's no value to it compared to the international markets, compared to international standard of living. Do I want my content to come from those places? No. So if 10 people viewed that, mean that you made um, $5. If 10 people viewed mine, I would have made like $15 from the same views me and you have. So what I need to make $1,000 is not what you need to make $1,000. So you can make, you can have like 1 million views and I have just 100 views and I make more than you. Hmm. Because my content is coming from, my content is viewed in S and X locations, while yours is viewed in other locations. So my aim, my aim is to make sure that I make content that some people, so okay, like my creators, I tell them, don't speak pigeon. Anybody that speak pigeon, I make sure that they don't post that thing. 
My, some of my creators who post video on their platform, I'll go and see the spook pigeon, I'll go and tell the um, the manager to bring it down. Because why? If you speak pigeon three times, your greeting will see that you're speaking pigeon and we carry your video and show to the pigeon speaking people. And who are these people? The people that the Bulaba economy. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I, I teach something. I say, if you want to serve that economy, serve those that economy on platforms that are not monetized. You can't serve those economy in on um, um, OVP. If not, you're just going to be killing your platform. You're just going to be making content and be frustrated. And say, I have a lot of views. Why am I getting $2,000? What's OVP? Like online and um, video platforms okay what am i making to uh, two thousand dollars for video that got um five thousand five million views you don't know where this thing is coming from you know there are other technical things too that that are involved in making a video optimizing a video for monetization and then i think i i promised that i was going to give like a free um um, course a free master class on this thing by December. I'll try and fulfill it and make sure that by December at least I get some content creators to come sit down and I talk to them about it. You know. Wow. Imagine being popular in Nigeria, being rich in Nigeria, then you come to America and you can't afford basic things. Like, let me tell you one thing. I went out yesterday with um, friends. And we we ate after eating. The bill came, and it was eighty-two dollars. And I wanted to pay. And then the Nigerian mental, the Nigerian man in me just came. I said, hey, Jesus, wait. We use eighty-two thousand naira job. Ah, God. <laughs> you know. So, but then I can sit down here and talk about money and talk about money and talk, but at the end of the day, I just also want to mention that content creation is not about money, it's about happiness. Mm. It's about being able to laugh while you make other people laugh. Like when I say, con I'm talking about con comic content creation. Okay. It's about being able to make people laugh. In fact, in order to be safe and live long, Make sure that if you're a content creator, most part of your money go to the society of special orphanage homes because it's you don't even know how your inspiration is coming. If you were alone, sometimes you'd be alone and want to think, you can't think anything. So that thing is mysterious. I always advise people make sure, make sure that you're not making money and using the money. I mean, you you have to use the money, drive a good car or something, but that is not what is important. What is important is the place you come from, and the reason why you're a content creator is that society. That society made you. Most of the videos I have made, the inspiration came from my society. So I think I, I feel like I'm working for the society where I come from. I feel like I'm working for the people who are less, you know, who do not have the privilege, you know, to work. So, and that is what has kept us, you know, every day we are like upcoming content creators every day. Like upcoming content creators. Normally we would have been tired, but we we'll remember that there are people that are going to go hungry. We don't give up. So we should have a, you should have a drive because content creation is weary. It can be frustrating. Sometimes you might even just become depressed. You might get depressed. It, it gets lonely. lonely. They say lonely at the top. Yes, it's very lonely out here. So you have to have something that will keep the blood running and circulating. The only time you think that there are children that are going to go hungry if I don't do this, you just get up from your bed, open your computer, and walk. <laughs> <laughs>